Alright guys, welcome back. So I use Jesus Boss. Basically because this game is so RNG heavy, if you do what I did, make sure those guys are out of frame before you start the fight. And uh, you know, wait until it's saved. As you can see now, the little yellow dots back the dusk. Then you can just reset your console every time you lose until you win. Which is probably what we're gonna end up doing. <laughs> what? Did you come here to lose? That's my line. I'm holding nothing back this time, I'll make you cry. Oh no, he's going to make us cry. Are you going to insult me? Well, guess what? You're green. Nothing you say out of your mouth will be taken with a grain of salt. It's time to attack. Get the Omni Disc into him. Okay, he's already killed both his henchmen. That's really good. It's actually really odd for him to do that this early into the battle. As you can see, he has more health than before. I think. He might have the same health, and I might just be an idiot. Alright, let's throw in this small recovery. Let's throw in our one MP recovery real quick, too. Just in case. We're at that point now where every little bit of MP matters. I'm going to give... Give it him call, his call. So that way we can conserve a bit of MP. Luckily, though, he doesn't do a lot of damage against us. I think typing matters a bit, and because we're both virus, he just doesn't do that much damage. Which is super fortuitous that he actually, like, that Angelon actually kind of died then. Alright, to get Death Claw up. Or, you know, just never do it. Just just wait until he attacks you. That's that's cool too, Devimon. Just wait until he attacks you before you start doing your ultimate attack. You know, your easily interruptible ultimate attack. That's always a great, great idea too, buddy. You know, that's just the best idea ever. Just just really, really just throw this fight as hard as you can, Devimon. This is take one after all. I didn't expect to do it in one take. Just, just really miss every hit. Just really just take it on the chin, buddy. We have plenty of health items from earlier when you got your ass kicked. Oh wait, no we don't. Because you got your ass kicked. Please. Oh my god, you have the worst Sonic kick because you don't actually go forward when you do it. His AI is frozen. Because he has no MP. Is Ogremon out of MP too? That'd be pretty great. So this is going to happen, we're both Digimon run out of MP, and thus no one does anything. Except chase each other around. Come on, come on, Death Claw. Really? Again? Oh my god, that was so bad. I'm going to sit here and wait till something happens. See, we're either going to die or get another Death Claw. If we die, I'm reloading. Because if you die, you have to go through this entire dungeon again. Without the items you get. Which is the worst. Alright, we're resetting the ROM. See you guys in a second. Alright, back. Welcome to Take 2. Again, make sure they're off screen. Walk over here. As soon as you touch the green, it starts. Again, it's so RNG based, but we're also a good typing to take his attacks. I believe if we had a vaccine, we'd be able to breeze through this. If we have a data type, it will be hellish because we take double damage. But because we're both virus, we both take the same we both uh, take the same amount of damage from each other. But we take the uh, normal amount instead of like a thousand. Let me tell you, doing this with um Leomon wasn't easy. Because Leomon's a data type, not a vaccine. Alright, so that freaking Agumon just hurt everyone except for Devimon, because Devimon was already down, and you can't be hit when you're down. Alright, so he's almost killed both of his cronies. Which is good. Yep, okay, they're both dead. Now starts like the real fight. Once again, very realistic chance we can win this, but again. 
Random number generation. Randomness in general is a horrible design for a game. Just never, if you're designing a game, never use randomness. Always use percentages. Not even percentages. Just make sure it doesn't suck. I can see why, why they turn to a turn-based system. I forgot to use the Omni Disk. That was my, that was like my worst mistake. I can't believe I forgot that. We're gonna have to reset ROM because I forgot to use the Omni Disk, and thus we've been doing less damage and taking more damage the entire fight. Height because of it. That was my bad. Yeah, see, we're gonna take way more, less damage. Wait for him to do an attack, and then Devil Hand or. Come on, come on. I really don't want to do this all night. I will if I have to. Oh, come on. We are one. Come on. We are one, like, little wing thing away. Yes. Yes! Oh, my God. Did it in two takes. My first playthrough, because I didn't have the right type of Digimon, this took me for frickin' ever. Like, it took five or six tries to get this done. Ogremon dropped HP chip. Or he'll always drop HP chips, I think, but I'm not sure. Wow. Oh no. And then they run off. Darn it. And then he does this weird smoke bomb thing. What is it? Bye, dumb guys. Darn, he got away. Chasing the elevator does no good. Alright, let's grab that. Can we just use the elevator? Is that a thing we can do? Let's get in. Oh yeah, because this is how we get... What's his face? Alright. Now then, this should lead, if I'm correct, to... Yeah, the Great Canyon Bridge. But doesn't this lead to Freeze Land? Are you kidding me with this? No, we cannot get past without fighting him. There's no way. There's actually no way we can do this without without dying. I, I'm calling shenanigans. No. Are you kidding me? I have to leave! It's horrible! Who designed that? He doesn't, he never really, like, you might be like, oh, Gaburumon are on his side, because, you know, Gaburumon and Gabagurumon, they, like, digivolve into each other, right? Well, yeah, but in this game, they never work with him, so that's just a random Gaburumon he walked, he just happened to walk past. Oh wait, this place is still infested with dudes, isn't it? If I remember correctly. Oh, it totally is, isn't it? Is there something behind this? There's like a secret lever or something you can pull. But yeah, if I go out here, I'm just gonna get attacked, aren't I? And I haven't saved. Okay, we don't get attacked. Oh my god, do I keep risking it and going deeper in? That's the thing that we could just end up dying and losing a bunch of happiness and then losing Devmont immediately. I know he's very close to the edge of his rope, and we can't really do Ogremon's next section because his next section is kind of extremely difficult. And we need, like, much stronger Digimon. I think we're just going to autopilot out. This is a no win situation. We just got to autopilot out and just stick with our win. Which got done really quick. I was to, I was expecting to devote an entire video to fighting Ogremon. So that second fight is so difficult compared to the first. It's ridiculous. It's completely and totally ridiculous. You can... If you don't save there, which I recommend doing so much, save it there so you can reset your console because you will have to keep going over and over again to that exact same point fighting the exact same dude Huh? Okay, he's just selling his works at the store now.
Alright, so I believe this is all you can buy at the store now. Super Restore, which is a big press start to sell stuff. Full HP and Cure's Coma, which is you passing out. Let's grab like seven of these. And then um, we'll grab the rest in this. And we'll grab like one normal MP floppy for the sake of it. Oh, we can buy a little more. Uh, no, we can't. We don't have any room. Alright. So, um, I'm sorry for the short episode. Um, I'm not really quite sure what to do right now. I didn't expect it to end that soon. I was like, oh, this is gonna be like five, six times tops that we're gonna have to fight Ogremon, but not nah, just two. Uh, I guess we'll go over here, like, hit up the clinic and get healed. Hopefully it heals us. Demon looks fine. What do you need? Get rid of his tiredness? It's fine, just watch me get rid of his tired. Like, really? He just sleeps here and regains a little bit? That's so crappy. Oh my god, that's so bad. That This is a clinic, that should be a full heal. That's what upgrades do. Oh my god, this game is like... The, the shine has come off the apple with this game, and I'm just... Starting to realize how bad it really is. Also, the black block that was that was here isn't here anymore. Yay! Um, I have no idea what we're supposed to do right now. I think if we go to Freeze Land and then backtrack backwards through where we came from to the elevator, then we just gotta like beat that Gabruimon backwards, write it back down, and yeah, okay. Let's try to get Shaman this by the end of this episode. That shouldn't be too hard. Well, I mean, it could be extremely difficult. We are low on HP, but, you know... Just gotta deal with it. Just gotta deal, yo. Alright. Off this way we go, where we stop, nobody knows, except you know I do, because... And you should too, because you know where we're going. Devmon has been a real treat for us. He has shown me, like, everything different with this game, like, mechanics I don't even know about. Like, the fact that uh, a virus type and a virus type don't do as much damage to each other as a virus does to a data, which means that a vaccine type will do way more damage to a data type. Or will do way more damage to a virus type, which is really good to note. Which actually means that that's emulated from Digimon Cyber Sleuth. Or, Digimon Cyber Sleuth got that from here, which is pretty cool. We could go talk to What's-His-Face and Underdell before we end the episode, but... I don't know what that would accomplish at this point. He's clearly not coming. What are we gonna do? Like, what, what, do, we, what do you do about someone who says, I'm gonna go to the city, and it never comes? I thought like that was a huge oversight. Like, someone messed up. That, that, that was one of those times where someone messed up coding something. Like, this got rushed at the door a little a little too quick. Get, get in here, what? There's a weird invisible wall there. Um, okay, this isn't the right way. Just immediately gonna point that out. We have to go up one more and then this way. To the left. Alright. This Devimon, for all intents and purposes, should be dead by now. Like, just, the fact that its happiness is slightly above 75, yeah, just slightly above it, has given it its, given it its maximum lifespan. Which is just beyond me how we did that. Those bars are so hard to manage. This is like a, the pickiest Tamagotchi he ever created. So if we go up this way, why am I trying to cut that close? We can't afford to fight. Alright, if we go this way, we'll hit freeze land. And then we find out that there's another entrance right over here. That leads right back into Great Canyon. Yeah, who knew? Right? But there's another entrance. Help me. I hear a voice from above. Anybody there? Anybody there? Yes, there is. Help me, the ground is bulging up. You gotta be kidding. 
No, it's true. I hear some machinery noises. Machine? It must be coming from Ogremon's hideout. You must have done something wrong there, no? I did many things. It could be the elevator. I'll go have go back to the hideout and check. Thanks. He's cool about us trapping him there. Yeah, you can't. You have to fight this guy. Luckily, the Brumon are pretty weak. So let's get plenty of healing items in case like we need them. Yeah, he, he doesn't stand a chance. This is a really strong attack, though. A really good one, at least. It's weird, because those two side ones come out first, and then the other one, other, like, one in front comes out. So you can be interrupted with just the side ones out. Which has happened, like, twice now in this playthrough. Also, what you just saw was a post-mortem hit. That can happen with any Digimon that you fight, and it's bullshit. Because if you beat a Digimon with, like, one health, and then he does an attack like that that doesn't hit for a little while, you can't interrupt that. So you're going to get hit for that one health as that Digimon dies. And it's the worst when it comes to boss fights. I have had it happen to me at least twice when I was a kid. And let me tell you, those were the most infuriating deaths I've ever had. Because you have to refight it. It does not count as a victory. You have to refight that entire boss. Because they didn't take into account those post-mortem hits. Well, it's that, that, it's that red flare thing that uh, Miramon can do. Like, that's very easily, like, get hittable by. Again, it sucks that you get hit by it. I think we just walk back. If not, I'm gonna, like, hold... I'm gonna get ready to press the, uh, right button just to make sure... Okay. Alright, it's, like, right over here, too. Now comes some real spoils. Defense chip. Okay, these are chips. Is there more over here? Yeah, okay, what's this? Uh, that's, an, that's a disc. We don't really need discs. Offense chip. Okay, these are two offense chips here. Um, what can we just use up real quick? Um, this happy stream. Let's just give it to him and see if it makes him sick or not. Alright, he's cool. Yeah, he's super happy now. And he's hungry. There should be something to pull here to turn off, like, the thing. Let's turn off the elevator. Okay, there's another sirloin. That's actually really nice. Alright, so I'm gonna grab these offense uh, chips. And then we'll just head back up and get Shelmon. We have to go up the long way, though. Which sucks. But hey, what you gonna do? Oh, that's a defense chip. Um... Why'd I buy this? You can just have it. Alright, so we're walking around with like four chips right now. This is super risky. Alright, no one here. Luckily. There shouldn't be anyone at the entrance either, I think. If not, then we'll just go up real quick and then we'll find another way out. No, okay, we're out of here. Awesome. We got out of the fortress unscathed. Yeah, those, those guys do respawn if you don't kill Ogremon. Oh, boy. Devmon's been a great Digimon for us. I love him to death. He has outlived what I expected him to, like, 400 full. No, I don't want to fight fucking Weedmon. What's our HP looking like anyways? No, we need to get out of here. We need to get out of here right now. Come on, I want to finish this week up with, uh, with one more. Come on, one more Digimon. Just give me one more. Oh, come on, really? He's just going to flop into me? There's no way to avoid that? Oh my god, we got knocked out. No, 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 come on. I am so fucking tempted to reset. That was the worst, which means we've lost all those chips, I think. We've lost a ton of items. Because every Digimon who kills you gets all of your shit and half your money. Let's look at what we lost. 
Let's see how many irreplaceable items we lost. Um, one, we lost the defense chip. That's literally the best case scenario of what we lose. It's just the defense chip. You know what? Fuck Shelmon. Like, yeah, I'm gonna say it. Fuck Shelmon for right now. We'll get him next week. I said we're gonna end this episode off, and we're going with getting him. Well, I don't think we can do it. We have, like, no defense chips. We have no defense chips. We had one. Now it's gone. Those are, like, the most rare chips in the game. We just lost one. I'm going to see you guys later. See him right. Just great construct of this stuff. And next time on Digimon, we'll be doing, I don't know, something with Devimon again. He's our longest lived so far, even though he's died twice, technically. See you then.